Welcome to Penny Magnet. Right now, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can upgrade your Mac Mini with a SSD. Okay. Now there are two ways you can do it. Okay. The first is you can remove the original hard drive what you get with this Mac Mini, and the second is you can put this kind of flash SSD on your Mac. Okay. This is a flash SSD which you can get in. You know, you can get from the store, and these are generally used on MacBook Retina, MacBook Air and this is very fast compared to the standard SSD okay and if you are not sure what SSD is do check my other video uh, where I have explained you about the SSD and how what is the speed and how it works okay now this is a flash SSD you need to understand what we are going to do on this one we are not going to remove the original hard drive we are going to keep that to store data to store pictures files and folders and on this SSD we are going to install Mac OS as well as few applications which will boost the performance, which will boost the booting time, which will help the application to open fast and so on. Okay, so the process is very simple. The first is you will have to just open this lid. Okay, let me set the camera first. Okay, the all right now. So the first is you will have to open this lid, and the opening the lid is very simple. Either you can, you know, there are two versions. One is you have to slide it on left or right. Just check, you know, which Mac Mini you have. And on this kind of, you know, the this is 2014 version. You just have to put a little plastic something like that, and you can just open like a tiffin. And underneath that, you will get a steel plate. Okay. There will be three to four screws, you know, like that, and you will have to remove that. And make sure when you open this and you will pull this steel, this cable will be connected to the Wi Fi, okay? It will be here somewhere, okay? So just make sure you don't pull it, just make sure you, you know, keep uh, opening it, open it uh, slowly so that you can see where that cable is going and you can remove it slowly. So once you're done with this, let me put the SSD here and now and now here underneath this there is a hard drive okay there is a hard drive underneath this one and this cable you see this cable is coming from the hard drive which is below this little plastic okay now we are not going to replace the old hard drive we are going to keep it as it is but if you can locate on your Mac mini here you will see a small a kind of connector okay let me put this thing on the camera this one like this like this one and in that place you have to put one connector in that place you have to put one connector and you have to plug this SSD okay so let let me show you how you can do that and this kind of connector you get okay this this is a connector so the SSD goes here if you can see there is a place where you can put the SSD inside like like this so SSD will get fit here and this connector will this connector will go on the motherboard okay so once you put the SSD once you put the SSD here in on your this connector you just have to locate there are, you know there are two small plastics okay one is here and one is inside this uh, this steel panel okay so one plastic is here and second is here and on the connector also you can see there are two holes okay so you have to make sure that you know you place this holes into that you know the plastic thing and this connector will not move from the place and also option you have is to you can you know peel it off this sticker and you can stick there. Okay.
okay so I'm going to try without sticker all right now so we are going to put this SSD inside this uh, Mac mini and let's see how it goes so the first thing you need to locate this uh, this holes you know there are there are there are two plastics coming up here so you need to make sure you align it accordingly and make sure you put the SSD inside first and then try to locate because uh, the SSD is bigger compared to that thing alright so I think I perfect here we go so once you have put the this SSD inside or uh, once you are done keeping the SSD if you can look if you can see here there is a small screw which goes from SSD to the bottom of the the Mac mini okay so you need to find a, a proper screw and you need to fit that thing so that SSD do not move from this place and then then go ahead and plug this strip on the motherboard okay so this is how the whole thing will look okay you have this uh, the strip coming you know, getting in inserted on the motherboard here then it goes from here then it goes to SSD connector then there is SSD and here is that little screw you need to put so I need to find a proper screw for that mm, give me a moment So I think this this screw will be perfect for this. Here we go. So once again the the connector goes to the motherboard here then the strip goes and here is a connector and here is a SSD and here is a screw. So now this will not move from this place and as I said on this one we are going to put uh, the operating system and applications and on the hard drive which is 500 GB on this one. And once you're done with this, the close you need to put this uh, steel thing back on the Mac Mini and the plastic cover, and we are done. Okay. So this was a short video on how you can upgrade your Mac Mini using a flash SSD. Okay. Now there are other ways also that is you can remove the original drive and you can put the SSD inside the normal three point. Uh, you know the SATA 3 SSD and this is a flash drive but understand the flash drive has better speed compared to SATA 3 okay so if you're not sure once again that uh, about the SSD do check there is a one video I have made on SSD and how the speed work and so on so do check that video it will be helpful for you and as always thank you for watching the video and if you like this kind of a video do subscribe to the channel and if this video is helpful give a thumbs up okay thank you for watching the video have a wonderful day